Prince Harry interviewed his father while he was editing the Today programme. He referred to Father Prince Charles as Pa and said it was very nice to see him. The 33-year-old told the Prince of Wales that he picks his brain more than ever. His father joked that it was amazing his darling boy had been listening to him. Prince Charles today called Prince Harry his darling boy after his son told him he picks his brains more now than ever during a radio interview. The 33-year-old was guest editing Radio 4's Today program and affectionately called his father Pa and thanked him for allowing him to interview him for the show. And during the four-minute chat, the Prince of Wales said it was amazing that he had been listening to him regarding climate change. The pair started talking about the planet and the 69-year-old joked that people are finally waking up to his dotty opinions about the environment. When asked by his son to pick one issue to focus on, Charles said over the years there have been a whole lot of things he has tried to focus on that he thought needed attention. He said, not everyone else did, but maybe now some years later they are beginning to realize that what I was trying to say may not have been as dotty as they thought. The issue really which has to go on being focused on, big time I think is this one around the whole issue of climate change. Which is now, whether we like it or not, is the biggest threat multiplier we face because what is happening now is what I was dreading. Which is we are having to deal all the time with the symptoms that are springing up all around the world, and they are diverting us off down all these different channels to try and deal with ghastly conflicts and humanitarian and natural disasters, and goodness knows what else. But at the root of it all, much of it, is climate change which is causing untold horrors in different parts of the world. When he started the interview, Prince Harry referred to his father as Pa and said it was very nice to see him. He later asked him, moving on, I know the two of us could end up talking about this for hours and hours and hours of which we always do but not with a microphone in front of us. But do you feel optimistic about the future, for the world that William, myself, your grandchildren and everyone else out there is going to inherit. His father replied, Well my dear boy if I must say so, the fact you're saying this, gives me enormous optimism. I haven't obviously put you off when banging on all these years. Because if you think that, that is really encouraging. What I've tried to do all these years is to make sure that I can ensure that you and that your children, my grandchildren, also everyone else's grandchildren, have a world fit to live in. Harry later told him, I totally see it and I totally understand it because of all these years of conversations that we've been having and I do end up picking your brains more now than I ever have done. His father added, well darling boy it makes me very proud to think that you understand. Harry then joked, and that I'm listening? Well that's even more amazing, his father said. It's the family she never had Prince Harry tells Radio 4 listeners that Meghan Markle had a fantastic Christmas as Sandringham and the royals loved having her there. Prince Harry today told Radio 4 listeners that his fiancée Meghan Markle had a fantastic Christmas with the royals and said they are the family she never had. The 33-year-old was guest editing the Today program and his interview with Barack Obama, the first since he left the Oval Office, was played live on air. He grilled the former president 
who urged world leaders to use social media appropriately and warned it is distorting the public's understanding of complex issues. But the tables turned when a fifth in line to the throne.